Park with more on today's planned demonstration. Carlos. And a clear message by local immigration activists here at this demonstration at De Anza Park later today. We are here to stay. And this is the flyer that they've been uh, passing around on social media. They were handed out yesterday as well at all the demonstrations that happened across town. Now, the goal of today's uh, demonstration is simple, just to defend DACA after it was rescinded yesterday by President Donald Trump's administration. Uh, decision that simply is opposed by many here in Tucson. Our organizers are expecting hundreds to show up today. Now, several local organizations met at City Hall yesterday. Some demonstrators calling for permanent fixes to our immigration system and urging people to not give up. We got to continue fighting for a just and humane immigration reform, an immigration reform that legalizes, first of all, all undocumented immigrants. And that's key. That's fundamental. Meantime, here in Tucson, high school and college students came together to protest yesterday's decision. TUSD says about 30 to 40 students from Tucson High walked out and another 60 from Choya, most of them telling us that now is a time of action for immigrants and advocates of their rights. Again, the rally here at De Anza, Parks begin, De Anza Park I should say, begins today at 4 p.m. They will rally here, then march to Tucson City Hall at 5 p.m. and will uh, have have a uh, demonstration or a protest uh, in front of City Hall at 6 p.m. Head to our website, KGA9, for more information. Now, coming up in the next half hour, we hear from Arizona Attorney General Mark Brnovich and his thoughts about the DACA decision. We're live at the Anza Park this morning. I'm Carlos Herrera, Pat and Sam. We're sending it back to you guys. And